name is Sean Mambre and I'm a NAMA award winning dance choreographer. I've been dancing for about 18 years now and I started way back in 2006 when I was still doing my second year at the National University of Science and Technology where I was studying a Bachelor of Science Honours degree in Applied Mathematics. And when I graduated in 2008, I just felt something in me saying, you know what, you need to pursue arts more. Because I'm a passionate guy, I love the arts. I think when we look in life, we see a lot of people excelling in other fields of expertise. It could be architecture, it could be medicine, it could be infrastructure. But not many people talk about the arts itself. And I want to be one of those people who excel in arts. So, uh, having decided that in my heart, I then felt the need to want to raise the banner of arts in Zimbabwe. I think it's one thing to, to be noticed, but it's another thing to be celebrated. The fact that they saw the hard work that I was putting in, I, I was celebrated in that way. I've had the privilege of traveling and moving around with this gift. I've toured places like Germany and China and Botswana and Zambia and South Africa, just to name a few and getting to share my craft from someone who didn't go to school for it but was just self-taught. That is something that I'm really proud of and I thank God for that. Yeah, uh, I think my word of encouragement to uh, upcoming dancers is simple. Never let your talent take you to a place where your character cannot sustain you. We have a lot of people who are talented but once they get to their preferred destination, they do not have the character because they have not taken the same amount of time to work on their character the same way that they work on their talent. So I'm not saying that I'm the best in the business, but I've worked on both aspects of my humanity, the talent itself and the character. Because talent will get you there, but it's character that allows you to stay there for as long as you can be. So that would be my advice. I want to try and make it too philosophical or technical. Just make sure that your talent is sustained by your character, which you work at in equal amounts. And you know, when you're living in Zimbabwe, there's a body called the National Arts Council of Zimbabwe. And what they do, like I said earlier, they celebrate talent. And right now there's a big opportunity for you, the artist, to end in your work so that it can be adjudicated. And then maybe you too can be a number award winning 